glad the LGBTQ plus advocacy group just won an Emmy Award. I spoke to GLAAD President and CEO, Sarah Kate Ellis. There's a lot of talk, of course, about misinformation being spread by AI and social platforms. Are you worried that the LGBTQ plus community will be targeted? I am absolutely 100% worried. Um, I think I, I would be under a rock if I weren't. And um, I know, so, Web 2.0, and when I think of Web 2.0, especially for the LGBTQ community, social media has been a lifeline for our community. It's been an organizing tool, it's been a, it, a community builder, and it has been so weaponized against us. Um, and so what started out as a really positive thing and still remains positive for a lot of our community, but most LGBTQ people know that, report that, they know that they will be abused online. It's just table stakes. But we are taking it really seriously at GLAAD and looking at how we're going to help our community and navigate through this so that it is an equal playing field. Well, GLAAD named X, the platform formerly known as Twitter, as the most unsafe major social platform for the community. In what ways is X failing? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> uh, sorry, I didn't mean to laugh at that, but I think it, it's, it's catastrophic, honestly, because it's, it actually was the, the one platform that we would hold up as a great example several years ago. Um, they had amazing trust and safety council. They really had conversations with activists and advocates of underrepresented communities, and now that's all been cut off. There's no longer a Trust and Safety Council, and it is a place for misinformation, lies, and hate to fester and grow. Um, it, it's been a terrible platform um, for the LGBTQ community, among every other mis underrepresented community. What advice do you give to those, Sarah Kate, who are getting abuse on those platforms? It really affects mental health, especially for folks who live in remote or rural areas who don't have access to community and people. And so I always say to try and find the community and then just block, block the noise, block the hate, um, be really, and report it, even though it, it helps us because we continue to advocate on the back end. Um, so it's very helpful if you report it, even if they're not taking action, because they're not taking action. Mm -hmm.